Part 1. Preparing the jeans. 1. Find an old pair of jeans that you're happy to distress. The jeans should be 100% cotton, as other fabrics won't work the same. They should be baggy, straight, or boot cut in order to make a true 90s look, but they can be any color. Prepare your tools at the same time. These can be found below, under the things you'll need. 2. Decide what shape you want the rip to be. The most common shapes used to make slits are diamonds, circles, or rectangles. If you're not sure, start with a diamond shape, which tends to turn out well. 3. Turn your pants inside out. Then use a ruler and mark out two slits in the middle of the leg, going crossways across the knee area. To look like true 90s style ripped knees, the slits should go across the knee, stopping 2 cm from the seam on both sides. If you want the rip to be smaller, then mark it 4 cm from the seam. 4. Mark two more, slightly shorter slits a ruler width, or so, from each of the first slits, moving away from the center of the knee. These slits should be about 2 cm shorter than the first. Then again, make two more slits each a ruler width each from the top and bottom, again making them about 2 cm shorter than the previous ones. Repeat until your last slits are only 1 cm or so long. Part 2. Cutting the slits. 1. Take a knife or a needle. Poke into the center of the markings of the slit so the scissors will get into it with greater ease. 2. Cut with a pair of scissors along the lines. Do the same on all the other slits. Part 3. Distressing the jeans. 1. Slide the cardboard under the cut slits. This will prevent any damage to the backs of the knees as you distress the jeans. 2. Use the tweezers to pull white threads out. Using your hands is possible too, but takes much longer. If the tweezers cannot pull white threads out after more than 5 to 7 white threads on each side, 2 cm away from the slits, turn the jeans right side out and use a razor to distress the edges until you see white threads. If you get 2 to 4 threads left after pulling without using a razor, if the slits are small as 1 cm, 0.39 in, you can pull the blue threads using your hands. 3. Pull the blue threads out. If you cannot get them out, pull the white threads to get the blue threads out, since the blue threads may be stuck inside the white threads. Then you can pull the blue threads out very easily on the top of those edges. 4. Pull the blue threads until you hit the dead end, where the cut of the slit ends. 5. Repeat the distressing process on the other slits. Part 4. Adding finishing touches. 1. Use scissors to cut the middle of the slits, where the white threads are, so it will be separated. Two. To look even grungier, take a razor and scratch the cut the ends of the white threads. Cut very gently to make it appear more worn. 3. Distress the square edges from the white threads where the slits get smaller. Use tweezers and distress the blue ends from the white threads where it looks square to lessen the square effect. 4. Wash and wear. If you have done everything correctly, then congratulations, you can wear your new ripped jeans outside. Wash then dry the jeans before wearing to make those white threads to look fluffier.